Hey everybody, welcome to the conclusion of the Somerset Strikers Battletech campaign as Jay and I finish off playing through um, these Link Narrative Scenarios, recreating the TV show um, that was the sort of the ultimate creation of Battletech fandom back in the uh, the late 90s. So in this episode, we've got the conclusion, the Somerset Strikers have re-equipped and rearmed. Now in the actual scenario in the book, they're supposed to keep all their damage from the previous game, which... I, in, a, in a full, even in a regular Battletech game, not Alpha Strike, I don't know how it's possible that you could wipe out an entire clan star and have enough left to fight an entire other clan star and get the conclusion from the TV show. So we're going to fully rearm and re-equip. They're back in Somerset, um, and the Strikers are ready to go when Malthus shows up. Uh, so we'll show the table, we'll show the forces, and we'll get this underway. Here's the final showdown. Malthus arrives with a clan star, including a... Um Madcap Prime, uh, sorry, uh, sorry, a Timberwolf Prime, a Hunchback 2C, and two Vulture Primes, and then a full uh, star of Elemental Battle Armor as well. To fight the Strikers, both Adam and Andrew surviving and repairing their mechs. Uh, Adam is piloting the um, uh, Awesome, hanging out in his little lance with the Sloth, the Bushwhacker, and the Mauler. Uh, and then we've got, um, what's her name, back in the Banshee. To fly around. Uh, the Banshee is uh, Katara. Yeah, Katara. And then uh, you've got Andrew Steiner and the Axeman leading the survivors of the Somerset Academy. More more have now added to the cause because they're so terrifying. Um, and if you wipe me out, you win. However, we will have a bat shell at the beginning between um, Nikolai Malthus and Adam Steiner in the Mauler. That's right. That's right. So we'll see how that goes before. And everyone just has to wait and watch. And then so the, no, if the we actual do that, If we do the bat shell with just the two of them, that's the end. Oh, that's the end. Yeah, so you can you play the scenario with everything. Oh. And at any point that we both agree, we can just we can switch declare to the and everybody else is just done. So when it starts to tip in somebody's favor, we can just declare the Bachal. It. Got it. Okay, cool. Sweet. And that's our forces for the mission. Right, so we arrive just in time, and the Somerset Strikers are still in roughly the same positions they were at the end. So an infantry squad appears to repair um, the Awesome. Another one arrives to repair the Mauler. Um, the infiltrator turns into a sloth, and then both um, at, sorry, Andrew and uh, and the Bushwhacker hey, are on up a top. Totally unrelated note. I, I love that Marvel What If series. <laughs> that What If series is great. It's perfect. What if. Ciro is actually piloting my Timberwolf Prime. Uh, he's the traitor. You're a traitor, Ciro! That's right. Ciro's joined Malthus, thinking that he's with the good guys. The remaining mech, mech warriors are all just bog standard mech warriors at um, Gunnery 3 and piloting 4. And then Malthus, of course, is Gunnery 1 because he's ready to partake. And uh, we've got the bat chow here that could throw down as you have repaired your awesome. All right, now your bonus ecstatic leadership is back, so you get plus one all hit piloting and initiative rolls. Um, I'm hellbent on destroying Adam, but he thinks that Adam is piloting the Axeman. Malthus will attack only the Axeman until it's a, a destroyer of the piloted Jackson. After that, Malthus will take on the Awesome. Note that Rachel's coordinating the Striker's efforts from the Awesome. For rules regarding her activities, you go to the Tac Ops. And the Banshee arrives. It strafes at the start of turn one, two, and four, six. To turn one, uh, before that, you do your strafing run with the Banshee. Yeah, so you know what? There's no questions this time. It's all zero until he's frickin' dead. <laughs> all right, so going into zero. So seven. You got it. Cranks him for two. Take One initiative. I rolled a nine. I rolled an 11. <sighs> all right, so I have to move first. 10 units. Yeah, you have honest. two, have... four, six, eight, 10, 12, sorry, 12, 13. So we're still one to one. I didn't like that very much, but I am hell bent on killing the ax man. Uh, let's start with the Vulture though. The Vulture's gonna move, he can go 10. So he's just gonna run. And go, eh, I don't wanna go that way. Can he jump? He cannot jump. So we'll just go 10 and hug some cover going over here. And we'll drop off our elementals. TMM2 for moving normally. Just pull you off to the side. I hate these things so much. I hate your infantry so much. Well, and they live forever. I know, because so I because I never fast. I never got to them. That's okay. I'm not gonna live forever this time because we're gonna send all metals to go kill them. I'm gonna go. Tmo one. It's okay. I see. I see what you're doing. And I will raise you a hunchback, who will also drop off an elemental stand. I'm sending my elements. We're just gonna murder your infantry. That's the whole plan here. Malthus is just so mad. I, I was gonna say I like how we both have a different, completely different concept of what is necessary revenge. Right yeah, now. yeah, yeah. Ours is to kill all of the people who were cleaning our toilets a, a couple weeks ago while we took over the academy. That's my plan. 
I believe in historical context, this is what's known as a workers with jobs revolt. Yeah, <laughs> so, <laughs> exactly. Yes. This. We have to put you down for ethical reasons, the way that we believe you should be put down. So the summoner can jump, and he will. <laughs> and drop some elementals. This is the leader elemental. It makes him basically TMM3 because of the jumping. Uh, the elemental will also jump, because he can. And just get in the war. <laughs> Continue the march. I love everything about what's happening right now. <laughs> I feel like I feel like we're not playing exactly the same game, but I still like the game we're playing. Um, all right, he's gonna do what cowards do <laughs> and go right over here. Ah! <laughs> Top of his infantry first. He'll keep his infantry attached. Come on, Ciro. My you sloth can do it. is gonna sloth his way over here. And my sloth is better in every way than my infiltrator, so he'll also be. I mean, he's a red he robot that. dog. Of course, he's better. The big red robot. <laughs> the big red robot dog. Sweet. Uh, we're gonna go over meow and drop off our elementals. Move that infantry stand. Because there's always more infantry. There's always more infantry. They never stop. Uh, can't stop. Won't stop. I I can't either. I'm going to move my infantry into party town be like come come closer you move that infantry stand and they are going to be the unit that destroys nikolai malthus so <laughs> you decided that just, today? You know, yeah it's going to be this turn one shot one kill <laughs> just 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 box special forces it. style special forces box car done what happens this entire campaign's been worth it <laughs> <laughs> I'm curious to see which of us is strong enough to flip over your whole table. I don't know. We're going to find out. <laughs> ah, what the hell? <laughs> right. These are the, they're plastic and resin miniatures. We'll be fine. I'm done. So it's oh, all okay. you. Yeah. Yeah, I got These uh, guys, sorry, stay mounted. All you have is all your battle mechs. Sweet. So, I feel like that's a lot of things to get together. Let's take the long way around. <laughs> I mean, he does exactly what it says in the tin. He wax bushes. Yeah, I'm. Uh, you are too. Not that it matters, I guess. Remember, I'm coming for you there. Oh, I remember. Axe man. All right. I remember. You don't worry about that. All right. I remember that. I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. It's coming. The mauler is going to maul in slow motion. <laughs> He's, his legs aren't the longest. Awesome. Is, or we don't know you're in there. Oh, I can't quite move far enough for what I want. <laughs> Which is the punch move with your punching hand? This. All right. You're going to go after Ciro? I'm going after Ciro. That's fair. Rachel! And that's just Andrew in the and it's just band. Andrew left, and Andrew is going to go to there. Be done. All right. Well, uh, I lost the initiative, and therefore must shoot first. And first, I can't see the axe man because he's a coward, and I can't shoot anybody else. So we'll start he's with hunting. Cunning. He's so cunning, if he, he had a tail, he would be a weasel. <laughs> All right, well then, what we're going to do instead is we're going to satisfy our bloodlust by killing a whole bunch of your recruits. But you won't. All right, so I'm skilled. Bet you're about to learn nothing's more expensive than regret. Skill three, I'm zero range, and I didn't jump. So skill three, I just hit on three. Your infantry platoon, so I actually, we're automatically natively plus one to hit. So um, it's going to be four overall. So four for two damage, the front one. I gotcha. Right, two so damage. I'm flip these to what they got left. Well, I gotta roll a critical hit chart because you have. No, I'm two one. Oh, you're two one. That's yeah, right. Or I'm dead. That's right. Here, I'll have you dead. So we'll shoot the same one with that and kill them. Then this battle armor is gonna shoot your sloth. Sloth is actually TMN one. Nice. He is one two though. Nice. All right. So TMN one one two. Um, we are oh, three. Sorry. I totally Four or five because we jumped six for your TMM. Yeah. Your TMM, we got gotcha. you. For how many? For three? For two. Oh, for two. Yeah. So okay. it's in your it's in your gut so though. Give me a crit for that. And I roll a five, which is nothing. Because oh wait, no, you're a vehicle. No, you're a proto mech, aren't I'm, you? I am a. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> so then it, nothing happens. <laughs> Battle armor and proto mechs might be the same thing. So I think it's your motive. I think you're half movement. Okay. Ever take criticals on the elementals because they just die if they take a structure yeah, damage? Yeah. Sense, yeah. Uh, then we'll go with this one and they'll shoot that infantry squad. Which infantry squad? The, that one there? Yeah, got it. The most important infantry squad. And hit for the two. Okay. That's Clive Malthus. Still in the fight with one left. God, I, I hope you got something to finish them off. All right. Then it's uh, Vulture Prime into the back of the awesome. Uh, he is skill three, four, five, I think, because we're over six, which we are. 
Um, and six for your TMM. So six to hit. Come on, uh, Steiners. That guy's gonna overheat twice. Whoa. For seven damage. Big money. I do. Seven damage. Seven! In the tailpipe. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Banana in the tailpipe. And then it's Mad Cat. You gonna Mad Cat? Gonna have to walk that off. All right. Well, the Mad Cat's gonna shoot you as well. That's zero though, because he's oh, only he's skill four. He's rolling against five his clan masters. Five for your TMM. I do five damage if I hit you. Gotcha for five more. That might do it. One, two. That's gonna do it. Oh, we gotcha. Adam's down already. Right in the hubris. Uh, but you get to go back at me. Well, it's just Malthus, the AC20, and I can't shoot anybody else with Malthus. He just stands yeah. there like an idiot. Yeah. So <laughs> we're gonna start peeling off infantry in the most horrifying way, I think. Uh, we'll go with this vulture. Mm -hmm. uh, no, we're gonna finish your sloth first. <laughs> So that's going to be skill three, four, five for range, six for your TMM. I missed. Yeah. And then the, uh, the uh, hunchback's going to do it uh, into the sloth as well. You make him pay, Sakamoto. You make him pay. Eight. No, I missed. You miss. make him pay, Sakamoto. That's it. That's all I got to you. I'm all done. All right. Well, Adam will take his disappointingly parting shot at that coward zero. <laughs> Go get so him. So it's going to be two, three, four, three. No bat shot for you. Yes. So that'll be three damage for zero. The awesome one is three damage? Yeah. What? Range, which oh is nice. Oh my goodness. Oh, three every range. Okay, and that's into the already scratched up. So one, two, three, zero. I'm at the end of the movie where you think things are going really long because there's like a moment of like tribulation and then they overcome. You're usually the bad guy in these stories, so this is a weird switch for us. All right, so over here. So let's start off by getting rid of your elementals. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna all die. So these guys are gonna be four and then five for your TMN. Yeah, six because I'm infantry as well. Because I have a base TMO of one, which is different from your TMO of zero. So plus one. So six and then back down to five because I'm ecstatic you're still. Ecstatic. Um so this is gonna be first. Three, three I'm gonna, shots I'm gonna go my right to your left. Yeah, yeah three shots are coming. So one. Yeah. I think two shots okay you want, don't they? Don't you only have two damage? Two armor, or I have uh, an armor and two structure. Yeah, I do, don't I do two damage? I thought I did two. Oh, you do two, do you? Yeah, I thought you did one. So three guys one. to kill. No! Yes. Oops. Two, yeah. and then so one more. Be, so then the third guy. Oh, that's into my structure though, so that's a crit roll. Nine. I am motive, so then okay. roll again. And then one more. I'm dead. Okay, so we'll scratch that. I'm gonna take him off, and that's those. We're gonna see if these two guys can reach out and touch him. Definitely. Actually, all three of those guys can. They can that too. That would be better for me, actually. Yeah. Oh yeah. For I'm sure. A terrible judge of distances. Okay. And you still also have your sloth. I do, but I want to use that for something else. Okay. Uh, so this is gonna be three rolls of five again. So one. one. Yep. Two. No. Yes. Oh, three. Did that too. Three. So two damage. But it's a structure hit. So roll to see what happens. Right. Four. Uh, Protomech fire control, so now they're worse at shooting. Maybe finish them off. Unless you're gonna try and kill Nikolai Malthus with the super crit. Uh, well, yeah, no, that's what they're here for. Okay, that's right. Um, oh, 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 it hurts inside. <laughs> yeah, I guess the. Could you, could you spot and indirect fire somebody? A spotter. Because he's doing nothing. That's yeah, right. Let's do that. Let's do that. Okay. It's one of them. Yeah, we'll just say that because it gives you a plus one to hit when you spot, yeah. but we'll just, you rolled a nine to hit with one of those so guys. So we're uh, three, four, uh, five, six seven. for range, seven because you're indirect firing. Uh, eight, nine because I hadn't added the range. Right, so right. nine, and then one, so eight. Ecstatic. Oh, I'm counting the wrong model. Jeez, I'm so sorry. That's okay. No, it's, it's only six. Kay. Sorry. I'm looking at Nikolai Death. Malthus. <laughs> Off to one shot. To that one shot one. that guy. Got it. The fresh one. So Sakamoto-san is skill three, four for your... Five for me it? being infantry, yep. Uh, five for being infantry, and then four for being ecstatic. All day. Three damage. Wow. Well, the charge of the elementals did not go well. Fear unarmored infantry. That's that's where the money is. Apparently that's what that's, that's what happens. You don't shoot as well, but you do mail or, uh, okay. gang up real well. Um, so the mauler is gonna take a shot at your hunchback. Mm. So this is gonna be three, uh, four, five for range. It's up to 12, or is it up to, what's medium range? Uh, uh, medium is 24. 24, okay, yeah. so it's medium. So, um, so sorry, three, four, five for range, 
six for cover, seven for your TMN, back down to six for my ecstatic, and the mauler is gonna overheat twice on that. Oof. This guy only has six health, so if you can do six damage, you just kill him. That's pretty good though. So. And then indirect the bushwhacker into him. <laughs> oh, we could do that too, yeah. yeah. So that'll be five. Okay, he's got one left. And I get a crit roll on that too. Yep. So crit roll will be an eight. Eight, which is weapon destroyed. So he's done one weapon. And then, yeah. See how the infantry did it, yeah. He's one? Yeah, he's four, five, six for range, seven for indirect fire. Uh, what's your team at? It was one, right? Yeah, one. one, so eight for that. Then back to the seven for ecstatic. Seven. Finish him off. Vault, can't do we anything never right. have saved you from that gambler. He's the only one who survived the last game, but he's still the worst. <laughs> That's why he survives. He's not worth shooting at. That's, okay. Fair enough. Here's the game ending roll. Okay, right is here. it? So, infantry stand against big red dummy. <laughs> so, four. Yeah. Five, six, seven for yep. your TMN. You got it. Um, and then six because I'm ecstatic, but it, none of that matters because it's only going to be a 12. It's going to be a box card? That's all it can be. That's all it can be. You got these dice specifically because they only roll 12s. What, what the hell? That's, that's the that's opposite a snake of a 12. Eyes. How is that? <laughs> How is that? You're hubris. I no, mean, that wasn't hubris. That was absolute mathematical certainty. I There's know. no way that could have been anything but a 12. Except now, it's not. But oh. your space truck can still kill my hunchback. I do. So top of two, before anything else happens, space truck flies in. So seven. And on a seven. <laughs> and then he does are you kidding me? With are the next, you kidding me? With the next roll, he does it. <laughs> all right, I'm just gonna <laughs> rethink it all your lives. I'm take a second here. I like that it's a New Year, same Jay. That's the <laughs> that's the important thing that we all the lesson we've all learned here. New Year, same Jay. I'm not gonna say space shotgun, but everybody who knows what space shotgun means so, knows every every day is a space shotgun. Just, it's gonna get real falling down in here in a minute. <laughs> Well, we've cleaned up the table, and it's initiative roll as Hold you go on, I, full I Michael one, Douglas. I, I need one more what if moment. You need one more. So had that been the twelve roll against him, yeah, the what would have been uh, another twelve is what you need. No, no, all would right. have been an engine hit. I can at least get on with my life. All right, all right. initiative six, seven. Is, no, ecstatic. Not anymore. Oh, I killed him! My excitement is gone. Excellent. The thrill is gone. I'm excited for this, so I have to reroll then. Four? No, eight. You, More you're, force. You still, you still get that. More much force. So I only have one, two, three, four, five units left now. So you've got one, two, six, eight, nine, ten, ten. So you're, you're double me. So you're moving two to one. first. Zero, I need you to get back in it. Now that you know it's safe, two, four, six. <laughs> He's like, ha ha, surprise! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> and then we're gonna drop off an elemental battle armor stand. You were the real hero of the Somerset Strikers all along. Blue! <laughs> You're still gonna, still gonna try and kill me with the infantry. Okay, so this guy's gonna go here. <laughs> the infantry so. move forward. Yeah, this feels, this feels like last turn, and then you and get to go again. That infantry will move forward. I think your sloth is still somehow alive. Yeah, that's that's just confusing. That's that. No one knows why, but it is. Uh, well, let's, uh, let's go Vulture down. Uh, we're gonna consolidate our forces, going eight and then two more. Boop. I keep moving infantry. Yeah, yeah, I, keep moving. <laughs> I see how this goes. Company, form up! <laughs> uh, Vulture two, Electric Boogaloo. So it's gonna cost us four to get through all this pile of flaming wreckage that was our friend. And then we can go six more. Coming around this way. The following Malthus was an incredible mistake. Yes. <laughs> we watched all of our battle armor die instantly. Get some of that inner sphere infantry. <laughs> that's, that's where it's where, at. That's where the big money that's is. Where it's at. So we're going to move up our elemental stand. Only got Malthus left. <laughs> um, I think you have that too. Oh, I do have that MVI. Yeah, it's true. I've got a, I got a stand left too. Okay, so you got guys over here. All right, so let's move the sloth towards you guys. You can only move three now because he took a motive hit. Motive yeah. hit. Broke one of his little sloth legs. Sloth, which is this guy. The bushwhacker. He is crazy fast, though. Go there. Oh, he's going to flank one of my vultures. There. Well, it's Malthus and the battle armor. The battle armor is just going to go. Come and fight. Death from above. Move up. Mr. Mauler. Uh, he prefers to be called Dr. Mauler. Dr. Mr. the Mauler. <laughs> 
You can go to Mueller Medical School and have a Mr. Mueller. <laughs> that's true, that's fair. You didn't do his seven years in, in Mueller school. And oh. come on, Axeman. Come on, guys. Do it. Do it. Do it. He's back. <laughs> He's like a hood ornament of the Somerset Academy over here. Backstreet's back, all right. We're just going to sit still. No, we're not. Yeah, we're just going to. No, no, no. We're going to assume the same position as you. We're going to jump. Somewhere in there, did I count an odd number? I must have it eleven. Yeah, you, if you're if you're odd numbering it, then you're at eleven. Okay. Well, we forgot about the most important of yeah, infantry. It's gonna be a problem. Man. It's a rob too far away. Ro rob you of your your glory kill. All right, then. Looks like we are done the moving. Uh, you won the roll, so I have to do the shooting first. Big money for the end, and start with the little money. So we're gonna start with uh, physical attacks. The sloth. I'm size one, so I get a sweet, sweet one damage. Uh, death from above for two. What is this? And I don't take any death from above damage because of the thing. So what's your TMM? Uh, it is one. So three goes to four. Five, six got jumped. I don't like these abbreviations. All okay. right. Ha! Take two. Two is one too many. We have dismantled the sloth. Uh, then we are going to start doing that thing where we have to all pick a different target. So we'll start with uh, this vulture. He's gonna shoot your mauler. T I'm skill three, four, five for range, six for your TMM, seven for the cover. Uh, so seven to hit. The vulture is just gonna try and blast you normally. Gotcha with eight for, oh no, that one overheated. Oh, okay. I have two vultures. Oh no, I haven't marked off all my damage from last game. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm confused about all this. Oh no, he did overheat for two. So he needed a nine. So he missed. This is the one that didn't overheat. So this one's gonna try and shoot over to the bushwhacker. Yeah. Uh, he'll be three, four, five for range, six for cover, seven, eight for your TMM. Yeah, just just kill that guy. I don't even care. I don't even care. I don't hit him. Just get rid of him. <laughs> no one likes him. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, and then my mad cat, because he has no honor, is going to shoot your axe man. All the Steiners, because they, they left us for dead. So skill of four, five, six, seven, eight for range, because I'm over 24, nine, 10 for your TMM. Not 10. Yeah! Take five damage from zero, baby. One, two, three. Zero, don't play. Zero is the actual hero of this whole story all along. Are we going to end this and find out the moral of the story is being a traitor and a coward is the reward? Because yes. it feels that way. Yeah, it's it very Game of Thrones. It's very Game of Thrones in and, space. And, 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 yeah, and, and. Choose, we chose violence immediately. Neener, 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 neener. We're like the, we're like the Lannisters of this whole thing. So it's just, oh, sorry, this guy has one in range, so the elementals can't fire, and then it's just going to be Malthus up top. One, two, three, because he jumped. Four, five for range. Six, seven for your TMM and jumping. Wait, who shot at my... Oh, Ciro shot at my axe man. Ciro shot at your axe man, because he wants revenge on all Steiners. Give me a seven. I do, for four. Four? Is that it? That's completely it. Yeah! See if you can kill me back, though. It's not going well. Let's see if you can kill me back. We've retaken Somerset. It's not going well. In the what if universe, the clan always wins. How bad this would have been if you had to carry over your damage from last game? There would have been nothing left. The scenario would have been an absolute like slaughter. Well, no, if I carry the damage over from the last game, I just have five infantry stands and that a bushwhacker. And a bushwhacker. That's true. Just a running around rocker. forever rolling dice and having no outcome. That's, That's fair, exactly yeah. what would happen. <laughs> you would just run to the hills <laughs> listening to Iron Maiden. <laughs> Run to the hills. All right, kill me back. Axeman against uh, Nikolai Malthus. Just everything to Malthus. <laughs> so he's going to be uh, three. Uh, Four, five, because he jumped. Three. Yeah. Uh, so six, uh, seven, eight, because I jumped. Nine, ten, because of range. Nine, ten, because of range. Um, <clears throat> I'm not ecstatic anymore. Can you overheat? At all, and I'm going to overheat for one. Because I'm going to go away anyway. Do it. Destroy him. This is ten. Oh, so oh, cruel. Oh, that's the end of you. Thanks for coming out. Uh, and then the mauler is, is going to try and shoot Malthus as well. This is going to go poorly. In his stupid face. Uh, so he is going to be three, four, five, six for your TMN, and seven, in. eight for range, um, nine, ten because I'm overheated too. No, no. All right. Overheat again. Shut uh, you down. Yeah, I might as well. I mean, it's gonna, it's gonna, <laughs> shut you down as well anyway. Yeah. Uh, so ten for five damage. For five damage. 
Oh no. no sadness. No, no. It's all no. gonna come down to your least favorite guy. Uh, Shoot me in the back. Oh, do it. If he wins this for you, it's gonna be the greatest if moment of this whole game. Survivor, you know this is how those like sketchy military fiction books where a dude was the only hero from his whole regiment That's right. get written. That's right, exactly. Alright, so he's gonna be four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> um and he's got no overheat. Plus one damage though, because he's in the back. Oh, so close. Okay. And then uh, the infantry? And you're the real heroes. Uh, so first of all, the sloth is going to try and kill you back. Does, can the sloth shoot Malthus from long range? Does he have no, he's only got short range. Oh, yeah, short range. Okay. So he's going to try and kill you back. So he's going to be three, four, maybe four. All right, do it. For three damage. Got him. There we go. Well, <laughs> super revenge. Um, and then... No one else is ready to think because all the infantry is too far away. Okay, I got the mauler and the bushwhacker after you get killed, so I can get down to the real business here. <laughs> all right, all right. So the, the signers are all gone. With three, I've achieved the minor How win was condition. That two turns. I know, and and I've wiped out uh, all of oh. the signers. The sign, the the royal heirs of the signer household you know are what? all gone. You know what? Normally, I say things like this all the time. It always sounds like hyperbole, but after this scenario, I'm never playing with these miniatures again. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, so we're done, um, and it's on to initiative. Top of four, the Banshee shows back up again. Killing the infantry is going to take forever, so we'll see if we can. They are the mobile infantry from Star Trek Troopers. Uh, Malthus is just mopping up now. All right, Malthus has gone pure war crimes. In spite of this, I have six, seven, eight, nine two, models left. Four, five models left. So actually, we're not two to one. One for one. Yep. Okay. You're moving one first, though. Well, there. Now it's all about killing Ciro. And or not for them. Oh, and or not for them. Yeah, that's right. Everybody else, yes. Not for them. <laughs> Fair enough. Go get them. Last of the elemental battle armor. Charge of the light brigade. To the left of me. That's right. Get to the right. Hello. Oh, I feel like I've seen this movie before. <laughs> uh, let's go into the woods today. Hello. Here. This all feels like uh, this all feels like a movie I've seen. So. Uh, other vulture is gonna move and go. He can't jump, so he's just gonna go. Not get shot in the back by a bushwhacker. To here, Zero, you're in charge now. <laughs> move to here, and the infantry is still advancing. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> All right. Uh, so I've just got Nikolai left. Yeah. And he's going to assume the hood ornament position. <laughs> Who is some as I belong to now, son? And this is the Balthus Academy for the Performing Arts. Yeah, I'm all done. Okay, you're, you're the new hero infantry stand. That's right. You're the, the new one that's going to go kill Malthus. I got it. Where are you going, Vaughn? You're going there. And go in there. And I swear you better get this done. <laughs> Kill zero. Useless <laughs> piece of crap. <laughs> and it's just your mauler. Where's the mauler um, want to go? Yeah. Oh, he always. Oh, oh, sorry. He he's going to shut down. Oh, I forgot. He resets the start next turn. Oh, my God. I completely <laughs> forgot he shut down because we didn't think there was going to be a next turn. Well, he tried to save his friends and it didn't go great. Well, it's time to do the filthy business. Oh, you won. No, you lost. So you have oh, to sorry, first. Okay. go first. That's right. Okay, so did you make it to six? Come on, man. Come on. So close. So close. I'm going to say yes. Uh, let's say to you. All right. uh, I am a TMM two plus I jump for three. No, it's not 12. I don't care. Okay. I only care if it's 12. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Miss. Is it? <laughs> Miss. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> I take a it only matters damage. if it's 12. I take a point of damage. <laughs> it only matters if it's 12. You start the journey of killing this guy. <laughs> All right. So let's start over here. So one... Uh, sorry, is I guess that, I should is this all to is. him? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so four, five, six. For infantry, yeah. Six. And I've got six of them. Yes. Okay. One. One. Two. Two. Go home. Okay. And so you should probably, have, we'll just say you started with the far ones, because then these three could shoot the vulture. You could definitely range the vulture. Right. It'll be sevens, though, because of the trees. Uh, yeah, sevens because of the trees. Uh, no, it'll be sixes because they're not infantry. Because the vulture's not infantry. I was taking one penalty for that, right? Yeah, but he's TMM2. They're TMM1 plus the infantry. This is. Oh, TMM2 I got you. I'm sorry. Like base. So yeah. sevens. So three rolls on seven. Uh, one. One. <laughs> no. And. No. So no. one. One more. One more point on the vulture. That's the overheated, not overheated vulture. Boop. And it's going to shoot. Maybe four, 
five, six, it's gonna be six. Okay. And he's got no overheat, so he's got nothing fancy to do. Don't do it! No. I hate you so much, Vault Rider. <laughs> I wish you had turned sides. <laughs> I wish you were the one being punished right now. Well, uh, yeah, I think we're just gonna start killing infantry stands because I hate them so much. Oh, thank God. At least I know you can't hurt them. So <laughs> we're gonna start with Jumpy Jumperson. He's gonna shoot at uh, skill one, two, three, because he jumped, and then four because you're infantry. And if I hit, you die. You die. <laughs> It doesn't seem right, but that's how it's gonna be. I mean, I'll, I'll do it. I know, I know. Oh, my mm, stomach hurts. Over dude. here, uh, we'll do the short range one. So three, four for cover, five because you're infantry, into the closest one. No! Yeah! <laughs> the legacy continues! Same thing in oh uh, that one. I'm on five sixes now. Or sevens. Oh no, it was, oh, there's no cover, so it's sixes. Yeah, because it's three, your oh, infantry, and then two more. Yeah, so that one in the open, yeah. And we're gonna shoot the Bushwhacker with the elementals. They're three, uh, four, five for your TMM. Nope, just go away. Uh, and then it's just Zero having a duel with his old classmate. Uh, he's gonna be skill four, five, six for your TMM for five damage. <coughs> Yeah, yeah we do. It's all of his armor. One, two, three, it is, four, five. That's it, we are done shooting. So, round, you come back online. Four, the Banshee reappears and gets to strafe somebody. Zero, just Always zero now. Zero. Always zero until he's dead. Uh, skill good, on a seven. seven. Got him. Two damage. Two damage. Gotta finish him. Uh, armor's one left. Very close to dead. Uh, so that's gonna be initiative now for round four. You got uh, this great. Five, six, seven. I'm down to seven models, but you are, yeah, you're good. So I got we're all four. One one. Yeah, one for one. It's zero. Resume retreating to the woods. It's zero. I just, I hate you the He's most. both my favorite and my not favorite. Just we're just going kamikaze in a zero. I like it. Oh my god. <laughs> That's fair. I just I just hate you so much. That's fair. No, I'm into it. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna make that same same move. Johnny not overheated. He's back in the fight, so he's gonna come. He's basically gonna be right there. Like yeah. Not quite in fit, the woods. So fair enough. He'll be there. Crushing some woods. We're just gonna say bye. And go 10 back to here. Bye. -bye. Oh. Come on, infantry. Yeah, I double dog how dare far you. Does that thing move? Uh, which thing? I, the Malthus? The thing. 10. Oh, yeah. Eh, eh, okay. <laughs> you creep towards us? No. I, I just turkey shoot infantry. Just stand still. I like it. Wait for us to just, just trigger stand. activation <laughs> so I can decide what to do. With that's that's else. fair. Fan of where I am right now, so we're just gonna fair enough. Continue being a hood ornament. So let's just. This feels like the trolliest thing I could do. <laughs> we did the trolliest thing. We could <laughs> that's do on true. Turn one. That's true. You did the trolliest thing you could do on turn one. And in come the infantry. Well, uh, we are now ready to parte. We lost the initiative, so we have to shoot first. So let's just uh, you know plug some infantry war crime style. <laughs> The one that's within six, go home. <laughs> Malthus, you're the best leader ever. They're getting too close. <laughs> then it's time to kick some back with <laughs> this mech warrior. He is skill three, four, five for the TMM, six because of your bit of cover there. Gotcha. That's gonna be three more. Uh, yeah, four more actually. Give up his shooting to get rid of his heat. I actually consider you killing him to be a minor victory for me. Because you don't like him very much. So I, I got just it. Don't like him. Uh, this mad cat is going to shoot some infantry. On a four, oh, sorry, Ciro is going to kill some infantry. Ciro, you murderer! So, yeah, that's going to be four, five, six for your range. Your family was in that infantry stand. Seven because you're infantry, eight because of the cover, but I killed him. Five damage. Ciro. You're the war crimeiest. You're fitting right in here at Jade Falcon. Uh, so that's all my shooting. All right. Far away this time. I'm pretty sure. Oh. I'm going to say one's in for sure. Two's in. Do Two. it. Right. Do it. I didn't move. Two twelves. Yeah. Just, just roll two, two twelves. twelves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. I don't think that was still a hit. That wasn't, yeah. though. So that's going to be one damage. Mouth takes another one. Here, if it isn't a headshot, then it doesn't matter. That's fair enough. All right. Uh, Volton Rider will try 
to kill Ciro. To shoot Ciro in the back from point blank range. <laughs> it's the easiest shot he's had in two so games. Four, five, six, because he moved. You can so do it. So this is six. That's it. You can do it. I swear to God, Paul. If you don't hit, I swear. this mission's going off the skyway. You did. I was, gonna, I was gonna do it Ozzy Osbourne style, just bite the head off. Uh, so <laughs> three? that is three damage. So one, two, three, so you're in the gods. Roll that 12 right now. And then he'll lay down. Finish zero. Finish him! 11? That is Mac, that's the engine. Engine damage which means every time he fires, he heats up. Okay. And if the engine damage him again, he's destroyed. And then my mauler is also gonna shoot zero. That makes sense. Yeah. Fair so enough. you've got uh, just cover and range and my team of two. So three, uh, four, five range, six, seven TMN, eight, eight for cover. cover. Yeah. So eight. Finish him off. Revel. Oh! oh no! The infantry will be there and then you got nothing. That's right. Once the infantry gets there, I'll be done. Uh, so Sierra's alive. His, his engine is exploded. Uh, we've managed to take down Vault Rider. Is that actually his name or is that the name of the guy from Tangled? No, Flynn Rider is the guy from Tangled. Flynn Rider is the guy from Tangled. is the guy's name. Is the actual guy's name. why you keep thinking it's from I keep thinking it's from Tangled. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Two downs no, here. the guy from Tangled was useful, right? <laughs> like, he ended up helping Rapunzel. That's true. That's true. He was useful. Yeah, he did a thing. He didn't just die, die not a hero. Under five. Let's see who's going first. No space truck this turn. Initiative. Oh, seven. Ah, it's not gonna be an 11. So, uh, you are moving first. I have one, four. two, three, four units remaining. I also have four. So, one to one. So you're just gonna continue doing more crimes. You got, so That's basically where we're at, yeah. Take the slowest moving revenge ever possible. <laughs> Bye, says Zero. One. I hate you so eight much. And one. <laughs> Never getting revenge against me. I'll live forever, you see. I like that I'm the Cobra commander of this whole story. This <laughs> Pretty is fantastic. Much. Pretty I'm gonna fly with my gold helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> if the helicopter's made out of gold, uh, I'm just going to continue being a hood ornament because I'm loving standing on top of the Somerset Academy, just being a dick. <laughs> These guys are going to come back in to finish the job. Going 10, TMM 2. <laughs> Only one thing matters. <laughs> Well then, uh, yeah, let's just let's just do do a do a vault rider maneuver. Hey, we saw another I, guy uh, do it. This was uh, written by nihilists. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing matters. Kill him. Nothing matters. <laughs> Everything matters. Uh, you do have me in your line of sight, though. So you can shoot somebody. So uh, we're gonna start with you because you lost the initiative roll. So you want to Yeah. Shoot. So three attacks against Nikolai Malthus. Just 12, 12, 12. <laughs> okay. Just all day long. You you actually only need four, five, I think. Because I'm technically not. That's what I said. Twelve. Okay, Twelve. No. That's but one, it, not 12. one damage. Oh, these not twelves are starting. Two to get damage. Nerves. Three damage. I mean, you're blowing off all of his armor. He's got one point armor left. One, two, three. Uh, he will make another one of them suffer. On a one. I do. So another one of your units of infantry gets exploded. Oh, sorry, we forgot about this guy. No, I didn't forget about him. He's got nobody to shoot at. No, you're not gonna. You can shoot this guy. No, for sure. He's got nobody. <laughs> To shoot at. Okay, fair enough. All right. Um, we don't shoot at those guys. We shoot at that guy. Okay, fair enough. Um, I, he's only got one job right now. So my vulture is three, four for your TMM. Uh, take four. Four. And then my other vulture uh, actually misses because he's over six. Do you think anybody realizes I don't drink while we're playing? No, I don't think so. I think they think that we have like secret beer hats on right now. Uh, and then I don't shoot him with zero because he's hiding. This is it. Turn, Turn six. six. Well, first space. the space plane. Revenge arrives. space plane. Okay. So space plane on zero. I only have two damage, so Sierra can kill me right now in the space plane. Hit Come a on, seven. Plane. Hit a seven. Come on, space plane. Yeah! Oh, space he's plane. down! Revenge of the Banshee. You warmed it up with the Banshee, and that's going to put me down to uh, three models left at the end of the game. Zero, he was a fan favorite. All right, initiative round six. Yeah. You know what's happening. <laughs> no, no. Because he's that big of a coward, we're going to jump 10 back to this thing. The peasants seem very angry. Sure about these free births. They seem like they're unreasonably angry. Uppity free births? Yeah, I'm not into these uppity free births. Keep on, keep it on, free births. Come on. All right, let's go Vulturin. A Vulturin we go. A Vulturin we go. Going to here. Okay. Let's, see what's, let's see what's happening. More Vulturin. Go for a hike. 
Going for a little a big walk. And where'd you go? Where'd you go? Right there, this guy. I'm doing it by Braille. Yep. Coming for the Malthus. All right. One last moment in the sun for you, Hawkins. <laughs> <laughs> I have to shoot first. All oh, the vulturing. Uh, vulturing of the first kind. It's going to be three, four, five for range, six for your TMM, seven for cover. Uh, nope. Second one. Yes, for four. For four, so then yep. that's also a crit. Into the guts. Three? That's probably not great. Engine. So he's going to heat up now when he shoots. Got it. Uh, and then we'll try and finish you off with the, the Nikolai Malthus. So it's going to be one, two, three, because I jumped, four, five for range, six for your TMM. Uh, it's a five. I missed. That's all I got. Okay. All right. Going to win the game right okay. now. Right now. Right, right now. So the Mauler is going to be three, four, five for range, uh, six, seven, eight for your TMN against Malthus. Yep. So this is eight. I will overheat twice. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Uh, and he's got a total of five boxes left. Oh, this is five. This he is get, five? He makes it, If yeah. you get this eight, you kill me. Oh! oh! oh that was so oh! close. It was so oh! close. It was so close. The cruelty of the long rolling time on the D12 D6. It did, it's like it was doing it on purpose. I know. All right. Oh. Well, turn seven. Oh, you get two infantry. I don't think anyone. I don't think the further guys away and the closer guys not. No. Either. No. All right. So turn seven. Let's see if this goes. Oh, I think I'm actually out of space plane. Then. You are in a space plane. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It doesn't show up anymore. It's out of, out of fuel. Usually everyone's dead by now. Let's see who's going first. Seven. Is me move first this time, infantry. Uh, yeah, well, I guess there's not a lot of question about that, so. Do, 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 do. And we continue on our merry way. Going 10. Oh, you're at an extra heat, though, because I engine damaged you. So you're at three heat right now. This turn, yeah. Yeah, this turn. We'll be fine. <laughs> so that, that one's going over there. And then he'll go up too. This guy's just going to dirtle to here. Okay. The fact that he can move 10. I know. Where are you going, Hawkins? So we are going to back up. Oh. And hope that that means you can't move well unless you just hide behind the rock like the gutless coward that you are. And the giant <laughs> red robot. I'm just going to sit still. Ready to party down, as they say. You can just shoot first. All right. No, not quite. The close guy did, though. Close guy did. Headshot him. All right. Headshot him with the infantry. So 12 to hit. <laughs> God, okay. Caller is going to be three, four, five, six for heat, uh, seven, eight for range. Yep. And you did not move this I time. I did not move. So it's just eight? It's eight. That seems too low. It does seem too low, but it is. I'm out of armor, too. Uh, how many inside? Four left. You can do your final overheat and shut I down do again. I my final overheat. That makes sense. And if you get this eight, I'm dead. <laughs> do it. Do the eight. No! Mathis is down! Every decision <laughs> I made in the previous turns! <laughs> I can't believe Mathis is down. All right. Um, how much? How many boxes does the Hawkins have left? He has three internal boxes. Okay, so I'm just going to... Uh, I sat still, so I'm skill one, two, three for range, four, back down to three. So on a three, I hit you, and I do four damage, so I take you with me. No! I can't believe you're alive. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's just kill the rest of the humans. You guys are clowns. <laughs> and so we're gonna we're gonna take a shot three, four, five for range six because you're infantry with that vulture. Yeah, no, you're fine. Dead. I'm fine. No, I killed fine. one. They're fine. They'll live I, forever. I can't see the other one, so they're, we're gonna shoot. They're in Valhalla now. They're we're better gonna than shoot they were Hawkins, <laughs> um, and it's gonna be three, four for your TMM, five for cover, six, seven for range. And if we hit this, we kill you. No, we missed. Nice. It was only six. That's great. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> so you, you have two guys left each. Two random mech warriors against Hawkins and an infantry stand. Yep. Eight. Let's see who's going first. There's no space plane left. Eight is great. You got it. All right. So I got to move first on turn eight. Yeah. Uh, well, I know those infantry are going to be somewhere within two inches of that point. <laughs> so I'm just going to go walk over my hunchback's corpse. Hunk it down. You're just going to sit still with Hawkins? Oh, that's right. He shut down. <laughs> oh, my God. I forgot he was shut down. Yeah, I'm only actually playing with the infantry. Yeah, let's just go over here. All right. Uh, uh, your Pyrrhic victory costs you everything. 
to there. It's your way. <laughs> All right. Uh, so uh, you shoot first with your one stand of guys Different into time. him, I think. Yeah. Yeah, but no. Just, no, okay. No. <laughs> Close enough. Uh, so three, just, four for cover, five for infantry. Done. You have like a participation ribbon. Six, seven. I don't actually have anything. I have a, I have a doomsday clock. Why, That's all I can do. I even get this. Why I give you a participation ribbon. Why am I even here? I don't, know. I don't know why we do anything most of the time. <laughs> on an eight. Ha! Take that infantry. And then do I kill Hawkins on a three, uh, four for cover? <laughs> That's it. Because you don't have a TMM right now. Dead. Wah, wah. And that's it! But everyone's dead. It's just two random Jade Falcon Mac Warriors retaking Somerset as we managed to wipe out the human population. Um, all the Steiners are gone. Malthus is gone. It's the most Pyrrhic of Did victories. Did you really just shoot 10 hours of video just to teach people about the cost of war? Well, that's like, it. That's all I did. That's not a fun wargaming channel. What are you doing? That's it. We went all ma we went all late season mash at the end of this thing. Where Hawkeye's just all's, like... All's quiet on the Somerset front. <laughs> that's basically it, yeah. All you've learned is that war, war revenge basically doesn't ever get you anything. When the campaign was all said and done, this is what we painted to play through this entire book. And this is all the models needed, basically, to play all these scenarios. It's a bananas amount of stuff. Jade Falcon, we had Kristen and Malthus, along with a huge pile of other battle mechs um, and some elemental battle armor. Lots of infantry stands um, to represent the Somerset Lake Academy. And then all of these Somerset Strikers right here, all done in the appropriate miniatures, basically, to, to represent what was in the TV show. Then we have some Karita forces uh, and some rebels. Yeah, along with ISF and the rebels, along with uh, Sakamoto's Hatamo Chi. That's right. I hope I'm saying that right. Hatamoto Chi, yep. <coughs> and then these are the, who are these guys? I've already forgotten. They were the garrison <laughs> from the first episode. Yeah, the Wotan or whatever, the taking of Wotan. Was yeah, the Wotan Tamar March Militia. That's right, the Wotan Tamar March Militia. It's all made up of like wolfhounds, a um, mauler, and like a bunch of things. Centurions. So wonderful fun painting this stuff. And what we're going to do is we had so much fun doing this campaign, doing something wacky like this. We decided we are never playing with these armies again. <laughs> Um, we're gonna put this stuff up for sale. If somebody wants to grab a complete collection of miniatures painted to play through the Somerset Strikers campaign, we're going to link this in the um, like the comments of this video uh, so that someone else can play through the campaign book. Because it was like, we did this over the course of like a year, right? So it was a lot of like building, painting, and collecting. We didn't do it all at once. And I know Battletech fans aren't necessarily miniature hobbyists as far as like building and painting stuff. And if someone wanted to have like a bespoke collection of stuff representing this campaign from the classic TV show. We thought, why just sit on it like dragons and have a horde of stuff? We'll just do another book. So the offer will be, if you pick this up from us, um, we'll use whatever we get from um, selling it to do our next campaign book. And we'll let you guys in the comments discuss which campaign we should do next. And we'll do this again. Like we'll try and do these once a year where we play through a campaign book and we build and pay what we need to do it. Uh, this was a huge amount of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Uh, Jay and I certainly enjoyed like the fun zaniness of playing a campaign like this. And we want to do it again. So check the link in the description. You guys can decide if you want to pick this up or not. And we'll pack it up and ship it to you. So here we go with the end of the game. Managing to totally flip the script on the Somerset Strikers as we conclude the campaign. Now that was a ton of fun. And like Jay and I said, um, we would love to do another campaign like this in the future. Of course, throwing it to you guys in the comments. Um, some kind of caveats though, it should be narratively driven, so the same forces fighting over the course of the game. I'd love for it to be like a historic uh, Battletech campaign too, and I'd love for it to be in a new era, so not necessarily during the clan invasion like this one was, something different like maybe during even like the later stuff like the Ill Clan or the Dark Age. Uh, where just crazy stuff happens, or before even um, in like the Star League era. So yeah, throw out your comments, let us know what you think, and of course, if you want to grab our collection to replay the uh, Somerset Strikers campaign yourself, it'll be up soon. You can see the uh, link to it in the comments. Big thanks for watching. Thanks on Mash. Up we're gonna. Hey there! I hope you enjoyed that video. There are tons of other games already recorded for you to watch. Click over to my channel page if you haven't already, and have a look to the dozens of playlists full of videos. I guarantee you'll discover a game you haven't seen played before. I put out new videos seven days a week, and every day is themed to a different genre as I continue to explore the wider world of gaming. Of course, none of that's possible without you, the viewer, so click a like and subscribe if you'd like to stay on top of what's happening here daily. My two kids and I are massively grateful to be able to have the flexibility of this job so I can always maximize my time with them. 
If you want to support me, continue to put out this content, it's only possible because of my amazing backers on Patreon who support the studio, equipment, and model cost, as well as being how I make the bulk of my living. You can also help out by buying a t-shirt through Spreadshirt, a measuring gauge or widget from Death Ray Designs, or buying one of my games and supplements, like Last Days, Gamma Wolves, and Blaster. As a way of showing my appreciation, patrons get early access to new games and supplements that I write throughout the course of the year. Huge thanks for watching, it really does help out, and happy gaming.